what's up everybody in today's video I want to show you the cases that we love to use to store our less lethals now I have two different cases here the first one is the Plano box um, we love this sorry I can't get uh, the, the Plano box we like the Plano box it's a it's a nice big box. This is the one that I store my FSC in. And this is the this is how I store it. Um this is my this is uh one of my carry uh when I'm carrying it. I use that uh that holster. Um and then underneath here you have other spots, you know, layers and then on the bottom I I always have tubes and other cartridges um, just in case I want to take it with me when I'm traveling that's mainly what these boxes are for is to for when you're storing uh, not storing when you're traveling with your firearms uh, a lot of us are uh, in the less lethal and in the firearms community so I use these boxes when we're traveling on planes to uh, uh, for our firearms but they are great to store your less lethals and not have to buy a safe or anything or have to have them in a drawer somewhere. You store them in their own case with their own accessories right in the box. Now, this case, uh, I got them in two different colors. Usually when we're, uh, these are brand new because I'm having uh, a brand new launcher mailed out to us. Um so that's why these are here because I'm going to be storing those and these because I always buy one for me and one for my wife so we can both test them out and get our our opinions but these boxes again for those of us that are that are in the firearms community we know about these boxes these are the Apache boxes uh, they're from Harbor Freight they're about 30 bucks I got these on sale today for uh, $19 and they're great boxes um, these have the IP65 rating, which is the gasket right here. Uh, so they are waterproof. Uh, they are dust proof as well. Um, and this is why I, we like these boxes. And it's because they have their individual cubes that you can peel out uh, and put your uh, either your firearm or your less lethal. And here's my personal fsc and as you can see it fits very nicely right there i can even take those two mags and put them somewhere in there uh the good thing about this box as well is that it not only has the top layer and they're all the same as you can see the individual squares that you can cut out or peel off basically and it goes all the way down to the bottom you have one two and they're all the same as you can see they're all the same right and then you have your last layer that you can put your uh, co2s and or uh, your rounds uh, in the firearms community you can put your your cartridges there with your magazines and everything on this last layer you know you put this under it and then you peel and put your firearm here or your less lethal uh, but this is a great box. Uh, there's really not much to, you know, there's not a lot of stuff to cover it with these boxes. Uh, they're a box, waterproof, dustproof, uh, basically what you want. Uh, lockable with metal. They have metal tabs here, so you can lock it there and there. Also close them. You know, everything a box should do. Um, so there you go. Again, these are a great buy. Uh, normal prices of these is $29.99. It's a, just that regular retail price is a great buy because these boxes are expensive. This Plano box, I think it was 40 bucks when I purchased it and it's not, not nearly the quality as these uh, Apache boxes. That's not waterproof. It's not uh, dust proof. Although it does keep the dust out very well. Um, but it, it wasn't rated for dust, you know. 
it wasn't dust proof or waterproof um and it, it is lockable but they're plastic uh so it's not gonna be tsa uh approved so i would always recommend these they do have these in bigger sizes they have this one in that size that one i think is uh 39.99 uh and it's the same setup just a bigger box and they also have a bigger one that's uh 59.99 so this one is the 2800s uh they have the 3800s and the 4800s so there you go uh the like i said before this is a great box if you're traveling um i do a lot of traveling i don't go through through airports uh a lot only when i'm going to puerto rico uh, but when we're traveling in the U.S., we like to travel via car because uh, we like to go out and sightsee um, and stuff like that. So when we're going to Florida, we go we drive so we can sightsee. We go when we go to Texas, we we drive so we can sightsee. Uh, we've even gone down to Oklahoma a few times and we drive just because we like to sightsee. And we take these boxes with us with our. Uh, firearms and now are less lethals so anytime we're traveling we have two boxes a piece one less lethal one one lethal but there you go that's today's video thank you guys for watching